Hello everybody, it's Beard Boy OG here and welcome back to another episode of the Modded Minecraft Survival Let's Play. In the last episode, we built this magnificent stump. Yes, I built a stump. Uh, the goal with this stump is that eventually it's going to be a massive tree. Over uh, overarching, over, over, overreaching, whatever the word you want to say. Over this massive boulder, and I think it's gonna look really good. It's starting to look good as of now. And then over here, we raided this entire lighthouse. There's so much redstone stuff up there. It was a really good episode. I think you guys should really check it out. Could you consider subscribing? It's free, and you always can unsubscribe later. But today, we are gonna go mining because we are very poor for the most part. Nobody likes golden armor unless you're in the nether. And in this mod pack, I, I don't even think that matters. So today, we are going to be grabbing ourselves as much... Oop. I, I, I'm forgetting how my system works here. There we go. We're going to go to the nether. We're going to... Nether. We're going to go caving. <laughs> and we're going to try to get as much items as we physically can. I think we can get a pretty decent amount. We have at least enough to start us off uh do i have any wood product maybe down here in the bottom chest not chest but barrel that will start us off it will pretty nicely we don't have much food so what i'm gonna do right before we do that is get ourselves some type of farm setup going on because we need a little bit of food before i leave okay i've just fallen down that hole right there down to here and i've lit up the surrounding area this, well, not the surrounding, just the small area so we don't have mobs spawn on us. But here we are in a lush, modded cave. And we have a couple of items to check out here. I'm going to go over here. Let's see what we have. We have like a ruby-ish colored one. We have a bunch of these around. But we're mostly here for diamonds. So I'm going to try to look for those a little bit. What are you? Can't mind you. Okay. What about you? I'm assuming you're going to also need to be similarly treated, aren't you? Yeah, I, I need some iron. I need some iron. So we'll make this a little home, not a home base, but base that is kind of like a home. Now that we have some iron, let's see if we can get this up. No, we cannot. Wait, can we see it from here? Nope, we, can, we need diamonds for that. Oh boy! <laughs> Will we be able to get any ores in today's episode? The world may never know! So we definitely need dim ooh, diamonds for whatever is needed. We just gotta get those diamonds. Which, the problem is... Okay, so it's not deep slate is the problem. They're just impossible for us to get. So we definitely need some diamonds. Which, you're not diamonds, but what are you? More kite. Interesting, interesting. Okay, we have some diamonds right here. That's one. Any more? No. Yeah, those guys are over there. We're going to have to be careful. Okay, really quickly grab our polished basalt. I'm, I'm honestly not worried about losing this. Okay, let's try to make... Oh god, yeah, those things are in this game. I keep forgetting. <laughs> yeah, those things, they're like... They kind of look like the parasitic kind of mobs from... Oh, what, which which Minecraft <laughs> mod was it? Uh, the Apocalypse one? If you know what I mean. Yeah, those guys are freaky. Very, very freaky, but we are now up to four diamonds. They're a little bit freaky. Oh, okay. That was a mistake. Run up. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hopefully we lost them. Okay. That was a dumb drop. Dumb drop indeed, but we can at least upgrade to a diamond pickaxe, which is probably what we need for these other ores. Have I mentioned that I'm not good at the game that we like to call Minecraft? Okay, so this is raw mithril. 
Mithril. What can we do with Mithril? We can turn it into ingots. Obviously. Um, looks like we can turn it into armor as well. And it looks like just smelting it is what we need to do. Which is good. Which is good. Which there's a decent amount of this because I think this is the same block, right? Yeah. Now how how good was the armor? Oop. How good was that armor? So plus three. Plus oh, it's almost diamond level. Okay. I'll take that indeed. Anything that's at least diamond level level or better, I will definitely greatly take. Well, I'll just trying to make the most of it. So what I could do for wood. We do, we do have some of the bone meal. Some of the bone meal. So if we... Let's find one that would be obvious. Right here. There. Whoa! Oh, I... I likey that. Flowering Azalea Log. So it's its own log now. That is entirely cool. Okay, that is really cool. Now, looks like they don't stay together. And when you create azalea logs, they don't. Interesting. Interesting indeed. So we're gonna head over to here. We're gonna throw you in on top, you on the bottom. We're gonna try to get some more torches created by basically doing that. Now that I know we're down here, I'm actually going to take a couple of these as we go. Just for some, for not this case. And bring them back, because this is a beautiful block. I could build with this. So we can explore a little bit as time goes along that way. I'm going to try to focus on as much items over here as possible. Carmen, and with you. So about diamond level as well. And a uh, this is, uh, Mythical Metals, if I'm correct. That mod. Which, I'm getting excited already for it. We're getting a lot of really good loot. One of my goals for this entire series, as time goes along, is for us to get every armor type in the game. That would be amazing. There's so much armor in this mod pack that that's going to take quite a long time. But I think we can easily reach that goal over time. Especially since, for the most part, each one we're going to be able to find. Well, who are you? Look at the guy. Look at the little guy. Hi, guy. Let's try to kill you. I'm killing you. No, we don't. I probably just killed a passive mob for no reason. I'm a menace to society. Ooh, Axie of the Lottle, I will be taking you here in a short second. I don't think I have any buckets of water yet either. Can we mine this up? Is it going to be like obsidian? This is probably a really rare ore and I'm not going to know until it's broke. This is probably a really dumb idea, but I need to see if diamond is not enough. Okay, this is well over 30 seconds of commentary at this point. For the break. The world will never know. Hey, look, it looks like a mine t Minecraft painting now. So, not diamond level. Good to know, good to know. Yes, I know I have one over there, but I don't know if this guy is going to survive till then, so... I just want the bucket. Water. You're coming home with me, buddy. We'll keep you in the inventory for now. I lack my some axolotos. Axolotos make my world go round. Let's grab some more of this ore. It's definitely more spread out. Which, in a in a case for a game like Minecraft, that's that's a good thing. It makes you explore. Oh, we got a good vein. Well, I've mentioned that we have a lot of ore. That I definitely have mentioned. But 
The end is where I think it's gonna go nuts. So we're gonna get a decent amount of stuff from the better end mod. Or not better, better nether. But the better end has so many mod type, uh, mod, like, armors within its mod. The mod pack, the mod. In excluding what I've added in. That it's insane what's there. Absolutely mad what is in the mod pack. I'm not even joking. There is a set of armor, including Elytra, which is the only one of this entire mod pack. I can guarantee you that. That has the items that you're wearing basically working as a portable beacon. Now, there's definitely armor better than it in this mod pack on an overall scale. But if we're talking about just pure usage, it is the most overpowered mod, uh, not mod, but uh, overpowered armor when you think about it that it's basically a portable beacon. I can't wait for us to get to the end just so we can go and explore that and get the stuff we need because we need crystallite ore for that which would be really great really great to use especially for building terms I, I like being able to explore because it gives you just you can get natural beauty from a game like minecraft by exploring it's it gets really fun sometimes Ooh, i'll take this or i'll take this or indeed Ooh, it has a magical sound to it which is cool Maybe it's because it's mythical metals, if you know what I mean. It, well, I thought it was this or What can we do with you? I got a feeling since you're more common, more kite. I got a feeling because it's more common, we're not going to have any armor for it. I got a feeling it's more of a decorative block. Yeah, we definitely don't have anything else listed for it. So it's definitely some kind of decorative block. Which is weird that it required diamonds to break. Weird that way, but we do have the blocks up there. There's a creeper down there. He's gonna try to blow me out, but he's not gonna get me. What the f What? Is that an Azalean creeper? Well, isn't that a sight for not sore eyes? They're definitely not sore, sir. Please don't. I beg of you. I kinda wanna stay on just to see what he does. But he has his buddy there, so... Oh, book it. Okay. I want to kill you, definitely. Because I want to see what you do. Let's see if you blow up. Okay. We're going to let you blow up a little bit. Oh, that's cool. I was thinking that something like that could happen. Okay. That's really cool. A creeper... That makes Azalea pop up. Okay, that's cool. Because I was thinking in my head, watch as he blows up and Azalea just pops up. There's cricking time. Oh no. I forgot that creeper was there. We're really running off into danger right now. Let's pick up whatever you are while I still have a chance. We can get you out of there. Come on, hurry. So I hear zombies. I don't know where they're coming from. We have three of them, so... It seems like a lot of the ore is just automized by itself. I'm not exactly sure. I wouldn't quote me. Yeah, bread's not really that good. Saturation rise. It, it kind of sucks. Then nothing can stop this Minecraft Pro. Besides death. Death is a really good culprit to get in people out of their situation if you know what I mean okay we've come back from the depths of the lush caves and this is a loot that we basically walked out from about an hour's worth so we got a decent amount of raw copper we got some more kite we have mithril probably why the mods called myth is it mystic met okay now I got the mod wrong but <laughs> uh, a decent amount of cam mot iron um, a rich, a rich, a I that's not a great name to say. A Adamant Knight, Adamant, wait, 
it's Adam Mantite. Yes. Uh, Prometheum. We know that one. We have some diamonds. We also have flower and azalea logs, moss blocks, and azalea products as well. That is really good. So what I noticed here with the Arich. We're going to call it the Arich because I don't want to say its name again. Its armor is pretty OP. And its tools. Oh my. I also noticed that Camo and Mithril, I think what we'll do is that's going to be our armor. Because the tools on this is just so much better. I got to get some coal. But once I have some coal, I'll be able to start smelting some things. Okay, so if you're going to be smelting with any of the ores from, if I'm correct, Mystic Metals, you need a Blast Furnace. So, uh, the Kamet is fine, and the Promethium is fine, but uh, the Mithril, the Atom, and what we already have in it, the Orich, all need to be specially smelted in here in a blast furnace so that's something to keep in note as you're doing your thing with the mods so it definitely makes this a quick experience I will say that I kinda wanna do this this is a way cooler pickaxe look at oh I feel I feel like I am I feel like I've got power <laughs> mithril is gonna be really cool for armor I think and then Oh my, can we do, we might as well throw the prom there, it doesn't really matter. What about a sword? Oh, that sword's cool, look at that. <laughs> like, we have a diamond, like, we have something better than diamond, I don't understand how. Oh boy, and then armor. We all know what needs to be crafted first if you're going to do armor and then the boots. Even though the boots are the weakest of the of the items needed. So, bam. We'll take you off. Bam. How's that look? Oh. Kind of a coolish blue. We're going to have to take you off. And we're going to take our snorkel off. And our scarf just to see how this looks. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, it kind of makes my face look derpy, but <laughs> oh, that's fun, that's great. Okay, we still have a little bit more, we'll have to throw that in and see what we can make. Then we have the Promethium. Okay, now we have enough for the pants, which the pants kind of look like a scarf on their own. So, you gone you on oh we're armored out baby oh boy that looks good now we have more of the some of these other items which is like okay do we like, where do we put them what do we do with them that is such a weird look okay we'll throw you there throw you in there after that we should have everything smelted We'll take you there and throw you in there. Yeah. How about that? We're definitely ironed up like crazy. We're not ironed, but armored. I think the best course of action would be... Let's see what a an axe would look like. So uh, that could be good. Okay, that's better. And I'm definitely going to take that over and also it's going to look cool in hand. It doesn't look cool there, but nothing really looks cool in uh, first person. But that is a really cool set of just random assortment of items. And we haven't even checked into the red stuff. That is absolutely amazing. We're going to have to get some obsidian soon, go to the nether, and also make an enchanting table. Because some of this ore is just OP. Remember, our goal with the armor 
is to have armor that rivals some, like, not rivals, but to have every piece of armor in the game, if you guys remember. And we're definitely can be on pace for that. I know there's a lot of it, but we're definitely on pace. And, like, look at this. We are powerful. How, how quick? Ooh, that's decently quick. But I want to expand this more as well and keep on building. And my idea was... Okay, we're done with this type. We have some redwood around as well that we can use. And my idea is that as we go up, the wood changes. I know it's a weird idea, but I think it'd be really cool and a really interesting idea for a tree house, kind of. Well, a tree in the house. <laughs> well, I hope you guys enjoyed episode two of the Let's Play. I had fun. This was really relaxing, being able to go through the caves and get this gear. I really enjoyed it. And I hope you guys did too. Consider subscribing, because subscribing is the way of the future. I, I don't know why I keep saying that. It just stuck in my head. I watched too much Disney Imaginators history documentary things. But I hope you consider subscribing, because... We're on the goal to 1,000 by the end of the year, and your subscription could graciously, great, graciously help. Consider liking the video, because liking always helps. And comment down below. What are you again? Mithril. Because this armor is more OP than diamond. I will see you guys in the next episode.